was on my way out to get grocery shopping when I noticed my toenails needed a, a new painting. It's a fresh paint job. They're looking a little scruffy. So, can't okay, wear my open toed shoes to the grocery store without fresh polish. What would people think, really? All right. Well, first I'm gonna start by taking my acetone to it. <laughs> I wish it did tone ass. <laughs> Get it, acetone. <laughs> oh dear. My jokes are always this bad. Ask the people I work with. I have dads groaning at my dad jokes. Do, 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 do. And of course, now that I'm talking about my humor, I cannot remember any of my jokes, so woohoo. Decided to film in my living room today. I got the house to myself. The good dog is here, and uh, husband went out on the motorcycle. And so I'm shooting in the living room this afternoon. This is my big comfy couch. My friend did the painting back there. It's beautiful. I love it. It's me on canvas. All of the colors. Oh, I should give myself a full pedicure, but I don't have time today. I'm just gonna tidy up my tootsies and then continue shooting. Let's see, my big thing with non-gel nail polish is that I can't wait for it to dry. I never wait long enough for it to dry. It makes me crazy. It's like, Stacy, just wait. Just wait, Stacy, and I never do. Just keep going. Keep moving. I'm clumsy. I smear the polish. God, and that's just feet. Like, I can't even imagine waiting for nail polish to dry on my hands. Like not cool not cool do not have the attention span for sitting still and doing nothing for that long sorry Ugh. Oh. Lots of bikes out today, and here I am not riding my bike because I decided to try and curl my hair for you guys. It doesn't seem to have done anything. <laughs> like I literally just stopped curling it 20 minutes ago. It's falling out already. Womp womp. One of the many reasons I've kept it super short for 20 years because it can't do anything with it when it's long. Like people have fun times with their hair and they use the curlers and curling irons and flattening irons and blah, blah, blah. None of it works on my hair. It works for like a second and then within three hours she's gone. All right, I was using Expert Touch Lint-Free Nail Wipes. I got them on Amazon, pretty cheap. And this I got at Shoppers. It's Professional Remover, 100% pure acetone, maximum strength, removes gel nails, glitter gel, and glue. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. I like a little pump top. That's why I got it. I like the pump top because it offers me a little bit of control that I never had before. <laughs> and I've messed up many a table with acetone, let me tell you. Alrighty. I'm using OPI Nail Lacquer and it's called Romantically Involved. Romantically involved. What's with all the crazy nail polish names? That one's not so bad, but like, I've been at salons reading nail polishes and I can't remember what they are, but I remember being like, that's like a whole sentence for a title of a polish. Whoopsie. I'm bad at painting my toenails. Shh. 
should have pushed my cuticles back. Like I said, no time. And I should have started from the baby toe. So I'm going to let that dry so they don't smear and I'm going to do this side first. Do, do, do. Hope everyone had a great weekend. It's Sunday afternoon here and we had a pretty good weekend. We had a bit of a hurricane last night, but I don't think it hit, it as, hit us as hard as it was supposed to, Hurricane Laura. And we were supposed to get another storm front coming out of New Brunswick as well, but it seems to have been not so bad. Still kind of windy out there today though. Oh, terrible at painting my toes. I'm terrible at it. Now where would our pinky toe? Do one coat done. Now it's time to wait. How are you? Can I have it? I didn't think so. He always comes to me like, let me throw it. And I say, Gunner, give it to me. And he's like, go fuck yourself. Sorry, go away, mom. I'm not giving you my bone. And see, he drops it way over there. Come on, give it to mama. Give it to mom. Drops it way over there. And if I were to get up, he'd just pick it up and walk away. Drop it. Drop it. Leave it. Nope. He screams like a seven-year-old girl. Drop it. Leave it and I'll throw it. Drop it. Gunner. Drop it. Hey. The whining. The very reason I never wanted children. Can I have, can I have the toy? No? Can I have it? Are you gonna drop it? See?
Jeez uh, Louise, buddy. Anybody else have an Amstaff out there that does this? Right. Have it. This is actually a fantastic toy. If any of you guys do have like staffies or fully breeds, dogs that just destroy everything you get them, even if it says indestructible and nothing works and you're frustrated, go nuts. G O U G H N U T S dot com, or you can find them on Amazon and they make rubber toys um, that is supposed to be indestructible and, uh, got a great infomercial on them it's so fantastic so gunner goes up through one of these a year yes you do because you're a big chewer and when you get to the middle i'll actually grab the donut and show you hold on so that's we call it the pickle or the dildo for obvious reasons they are, we had one that was green and that's why a pickle this was a kong bone it had two ends and then a thin center and it was supposed to be indestructible it was 30 dollars it lasted a half an hour now we just get i call them his black balls they're the ones we cut off them um this is a go nut product as well g-o-u-g-h-n-u-t-s dot com and once they get to the red is when you gotta let, make them stop uh, chewing. You take a picture of it, send it to the company, and for the cost of shipping, they send you a new one. So these things are like 60 to 80 bucks. There might be ones for 100, um, but these are the two we've tried. And the black is more heavy duty than the green. So uh, if it, you know, we started with the green that lasted about a year as well. And this one's gonna go through as well. So yeah, that's not too bad. I'm, I'm not, I recommend these to anybody that's got a chewer, a chewer for a dog. Don't waste your money. It seems like a lot of money and it's a big risk, but trust me when I tell you these work. And he loves chewing on them, so win-win. Uh, a bit of an investment, but think about what you're spending on toys otherwise. Hi, hi, you're back already. Are you gonna give it to me? Are you gonna give it to me? Gonna bear, gonna bear, leave it. Hey, leave it. My toes are all dry and I did make a bit of a mess, but uh, nothing the shoes won't hide. Time to go shopping in my six inch Dominia pleasers from the Devious Collection. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, cannot wait. Thanks for watching everybody and I hope you enjoyed my short little clip here. Uh, if you have any questions or comments about the video, leave them down below. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button for me, would you? Um, I am wearing my anklet from Mara Winter at Engineering and Heels. If you haven't found her yet, go check her out. Um, and check out my Patreon, my OnlyFans, my Reddit, my Instagram, the rest of my YouTube. What else I got? I don't even know anymore. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm everywhere I should be on social media so if you uh, want to see more of me check it all out I'll put links for everything down below including the go nut dog toys again I guarantee that you will be impressed by these toys and uh, paying 60 80 bucks once a year is a dream come true not even whatever shipping is what $17 the second time around okay what apps <laughs> all right well thanks all for watching and hit that subscribe button and I'll see you in my next video